Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome back to a brand new episode of WWE Supercar. This is episode number 82 of season 4. I'm going to start this video off straight away with another platinum pack. Um, I don't know why it says that it's, what is this, a clover leaf. I don't know why, because um, I'm not doing a, one of those fusions. I'm doing a Titan fusion at the moment, another three days on that. But we'll quickly look at the spring stuff, guys. It's back once again, um, unfortunately. Um, you can only have one fusion active at a time. I thought they thought they thought they made this so you didn't have it didn't have to be like that. But anyway, um, six enhancements. Okay, and then you also get the three parts. And then here though it says that they're all shoes, but clearly that's wrong. And it's what WrestleMania 33 to WrestleMania 34, with obviously 34 cards. I saw Undertaker. I saw Carmella. Adam Cole, as you can see there. Um, I believe Dita was talking about an edge. I don't know if that is in 34 tier or not. But yeah, also the Road to Glory previews up. Event card is Jeff Hardy, so not a female. So what basically the last man standing doesn't really typically count as an event card if you want. Um, so they'll probably have another last man standing, female or not, I don't know. Um, probably the next last man standing there will be for a female. And that's my guess. If not, the next. RDRTG event card with this design will be the female 100% because this Jeff Hardy is the third if you're not counting Triple H um, so it would make sense that either the last man starting is the female or the next one but Jeff Hardy Matt Hardy is the Wrestlemania 34 undercard um, which of course is a single for me so that will be catalogue Kofi Kingston a time card I have not got my hands on yet so that will be nice to get uh, Xavier Woods, Kevin Owens, and then <clears throat> just cards there. You know, everyone's going probably about a million times over. Let's go ahead and do this platinum pack, guys, and then then uh, we'll I'll bring you back tomorrow with some RTG gameplay. Of course, as usual, guys, I'm going to be starting a very long live stream, uh, 9 a.m. for me, my time. If you guys don't know what what that is, your time zone. It's literally at the beginning of the RTG. So that is when I'll be live streaming. Right, let's get into this platinum pack. It's been a while since we've gone a 34 from here. I don't even remember what 34 we got from these. It was Luke Gallows, wasn't it? It was indeed a Luke Gallows. Right. I don't get who we get as long as it's not a Mark Henry or a Shinsuke Nakamura. That would be really nice. I just want a 34 card. But will we get one? No, it's again <laughs> worst possible pack. Two monsters and a Titan. Alright, just give me some catalogue then, please. That's catalogue. That's catalogue. And... It's either Akam or Razor I need. I believe it's Akam. Is that an all-catalogue pack? It is an all-catalogue pack. Wow! Brilliant. That's actually really cool. Well, that's literally the best outcome after seeing it was the worst possible outcome pack-wise. That is the best possible outcome. Each of these cards is catalogued for me, so that's really cool. I'm going to go and pro all of them right now. They're all going to be silver stars, of course. Um, Akam, it was the one. It wasn't Rays that we needed, so that's cool. Um, Randy Orton will be the next one. And then Roman Reigns, who we probably uh, would make my RTG deck. I believe he'd make that, that last spot in there, but it's just totally not worth it. So there you go. Pro Roman Reigns, that's three brand new stars in the catalogue, which is actually really, really cool. So that's it for now, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, of course, huge, huge stream, RTG stream tomorrow. I'm obviously going to try and get the first RTG done in the first day like we'd normally try and do. Uh, yeah, it would be nice if the undercard was a pro. Uh, give me, like, extra motivation. It's not, though, so we'll have to, have to make do. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you in just a sec. Guys, I completely forgot, but I have to update my recent pull. I'm, I haven't got it all set up on the screen, I don't think. Actually, we could probably do that, reveal it that way, bring it up on the screen for you guys as a media file. Because I have all of the images saved from those videos I did. So I got my pull in um, Royal Rumble, female Royal Rumble, very fitting because yes it was a female, <clears throat> um, it's not obviously a pro because obviously I'm not that lucky, hey, thank you so much, 14 uh, watch ever, appreciate the sub dude, you get a special shout out as you, uh, you subbed when I was recording, very nice. So who did I pull? Well, let's just say... Um, 
It's not a pro, but I'll take it because... Well, I say that because, like, it's someone I actually really like in WWE. It's not. It is Natalia. So, yeah, she will replace the Jason Jordan I've got there. Remove and put Natalia there. I'll put her underneath AJ and uh, later. But there we go. That is my last pull. That is my fourth single female. Now, I really need that pro female that will help out massively in King of the Rings and stuff and in Road to Glories. And obviously, not helping last man standing, actually. Having one female will probably not be good so hopefully we could get ourselves a second one um in in quick succession the event card uh will be the first female and then hopefully i can get either an ember moon and Jax, or sarah logan or a natalia very very soon in the soon future all right guys next time you see me will be for some road to glory gameplay hey guys welcome back to the episode where stupidly i just forgot to turn on to record this video when we got the jeff hardy someone's echoing as well brilliant <laughs> just just finished Jeff Hardy, I'm joined with Curbstomp, D2, Fusion and Kenny um, And they're all very proud of me getting this Jeff Hardy So, you know Yeah Especially yeah. Callum, you know <laughs> Call Callum loves this game <laughs> Just got the event card, guys It's very late for me to do Like, I normally I would have finished this on the Thursday I was getting carried away with Fortnite It's currently 3am on the Saturday as soon as I finish this, guys, I'm going to sleep. I'm going to wake up tomorrow, guys. I'm going to start another stream. Um, and hopefully we can do uh, we can do really well, get some uh, get some progression done in this heroic RTG. So let's have a quick look at the cards. We've got John Cena, Nikki Bella, Braun Strowman, Bray Wyatt, Zack Ryder, Kurt Hawkins, Roderick Strong, Pete Dunn, Shelton Benjamin is the undercard. Now, someone told me the theme of the heroic RD is... Uh, like tag team rejects or people who've been former tag team partners or stuff something like that um, Not not tag team rejects is a bit unfair, but former tag teams uh, Roderick Strong, Pete Dunn as you can see there, Kurt Hawkins and Zack Ryder, Bray and Braun, Nikki Bella and Cena Ooh, A little bit too soon there isn't it? Um, <laughs> but yeah, that's the heroic cards. Thank you so much for watching this video guys Make sure you drop it a like, subscribe if you're around here. Don't forget to drop me a comment down below about where you're at in this heroic road to glory and if I remember and let's be real I probably won't but I'm gonna try and link um, a couple people's twitch in the description make sure you guys go drop them a follow um, and check out their streams when they go live take care bye for now guys